Hello, Ishika. Hello, sir. Good, good morning. Good morning. Ishika, first of all, uh, I would like to congratulate you on your remarkable achievement. Thank you, sir. Uh, Ishika, you are definitely a trendsetter. And uh, I hope you are an inspirer. So, I would like that you share your success mantra for the future board aspirants. For me, there was no, not any such success mantra or secret. I just studied Uh, consistently with pure dedication throughout the year with the support of my teachers my family and all of my friends okay it means uh, you believe in group study yeah, right sir Good. so ishika how many hours did you study uh, i did not focus on counting the number of hours rather i focused on completing the topics that i had decided to complete on a particular day and whatever the subject uh, whatever the time the subject required i used to give that time to that subject so it means uh, you believe in quality right, rather sir. quantity all right ishika have you ever thought that you will top the board exam uh, i did not thought of marks or results during my preparation i just studied with full dedication uh, and our school conducted two pre boards and i had also attempted many mock papers and my score was really very great in most of them so i had a fair idea that i'll be doing good good ishika Keats saw the this poet once said, "A thing of beauty is a joy forever." And it means a success once achieved will cherish you in your lifetime. Right, sir. Okay, Shika, what are your future plans? Uh, sir, I am a science student and I am interested in engineering. So I want to pursue engineering in future. Okay, Shika, do you know anything about uh, brain drain? Yes, sir. Brain drain is when students who study from IIT or IIM and then go to abroad and uh, serve for that particular country. So, what have you thought about yourself? Uh, so, I would study. Uh, I would st- uh, study in abroad and uh, grab all the in- uh, like knowledge. knowledge from there, and then come back to India and serve for my country. Definitely, that's a good plan. So, Shika, how did you decide your study timetable? Uh, I made my timetable flexible enough that granted me enough time for uh, studies, for rest, and other activities. And uh, also, I used to take short breaks after studying one subject. So, Definitely. a break means a lot. Yes. And there is a lot of press. All right. Uh, did you give up watching TV and playing games during the exams? I did not give up watching TV or playing games during exam. I continued them, uh, but I I reduced the time of watching TV. and i mainly use them as a source to relieve my stress or to relax my mind that's uh, what is your social media involvement so i used whatsapp mainly for my school purposes and also to talk with my friends and apart from whatsapp i used uh, youtube and watch a bit video- videos in my leisure time and uh, what is your favorite subject and definitely why also so my favorite subject is mathematics uh, because i love solving problems it means you believe in analytical thinking right sir right. uh what message you want to deliver to class 10th aspirants uh i would like to tell them uh, like to balance their time between studies and other activities not just study uh, the whole day or play games the whole day just balance your time between them and whatever time you are studying study with full focus and concentration so sika thank you for sharing your uh, time and experience all the best for your future endeavors thank you sir thank you